Hey guys, welcome back. Today I'm going to make a video on how to summon custom villagers. Now, some of you may not have already made a video on this, but the quality was really bad and um, I thought I'd just make a new one. So, here it is. Um, so let's just get this thing, Mr. Deadly, and let's start. So, soon you can get up to two trade options with the custom shop, profession, and an enchanted item. But we um, are going to start with the basics. So, first we're just going to summon a random villager. So, we're getting um, a full... Uh, a few random villages. So how I did that, I've just made an HTML document uh, for you. So a random villager is just slash summon a villager and the coordinates. I'm just putting them one up. So that will be the base of your commands every single time. So you can see we'll get to something like that. Okay, so the next thing, we will summon a villager with a profession, which is their robe color and kind of things they sell, stuff like that. So, you see, we have got a purple uh, priest here. Purple. Purple. So, always be purple. And to do that, you just go summon villager, the base, and then you just go profession um, in your curly brackets and you just set the number you want so I'm gonna put the numbers um, in the description with the rope colors and everything so yeah so that's that um, the next one is a profession and a name so we have a purple the priest and we'll get that every time obviously so it's the same thing with the profession but you just add a comma and you go custom name open closed um, quotation marks and then put your name inside and you can do custom name visible this will just be for uh, you'll see his name no matter where you are I guess but it's not working right now for some reason so yeah I don't know why anyways so now we're gonna spawn you with a custom shop so you can see it's 7 diamonds for a chest plate. Bit of a discount on that, so it's pretty cool. And every single time it will happen. So this is where everything gets a bit more technical. Um, so yeah, here's the command. So we're doing the base, uh, open closed, um, curly brackets, and now we're doing offers. And then we're um, doing recipes. Um, now we're doing a list of things, so you put it in square brackets. And I'm going to just make the max uses 5. You can make that 1 million if you don't want um, him to run out of the trade. And the buy is not what you're going to buy from him, it's what you're going to use to buy. So ID264 is diamonds, so you can also write Minecraft colon diamond, and I'm doing count 7. And it's going to sell ID311, which is a chest plate, and count one. Um, so, yeah, that's that. So now we're going to do a custom shop and a profession. So, he'll have his custom shop there, and he'll always be um, a priest. So, very simple. Exact same thing, but you just add a profession right in front of um, your thing. Or you can put it um, at the back, but it's easier putting it in front. Okay, so the next thing is a custom shop name and profession. So he'll have his name, he'll have the shop, and he'll always be purple. So, exactly the same thing. You just have your profession and offers, but the cust you just add custom name and the custom name visible as we saw up here and now we move on to the last command which will allow two trade options a custom shop profession and um, you can add enchanted items so here we go his profession his name 
And wow. so one dirt for 64 emeralds. And you can wow. also do seven diamonds for a protection six chest plate. So um, two trade options and there's the enchanted item. So this one is very technical. So we have our base command. We have the name. So basically everything up here. And then the offers is exactly the same. Um, except if you want to add another offer, you just separate it with a comma and do the same one. Now with the enchantments, you just um, with the style um, you go your thing, your um, amount, so counting, then you go tag, open and closed, curly brackets, and then you just make the enchant of what you want. ID zero is protection level six, and the max use is one, so you only can do it once. So that is basically. All you need to know, all the commands and stuff will be in the description, plus the professions and everything. So I hope you enjoyed.